you make the assumption that they have the word coach in their title and that by hiring them, they're going to help you solve your problems. Come to find out they have no formalized training or experience working with small business owners. You invest a lot of time and money into this investment, and yet you haven't moved the needle in your business. This is not how it should be. You think to yourself, and you become frustrated with the process. In this video, I share with you what hiring the right coach will do for you and your business to put you on the path to your goals. Let's get started. My name is Jeremy Williams. And welcome back to the Survive Scale Soar YouTube channel, where we're passionate about making videos to help small business owners just like you build amazing and successful businesses while also living an amazing life. This is for small business owners that desire time freedom. The right coach for you is going to assess your current situation. If you're interviewing coaches and you get on the phone and they tell you how great they are, how many people they've helped in their journey to building this big coaching program and what the things they can do to help you today, yet they haven't assessed your current situation, that is not the right coach. How can somebody know how to help you without assessing your current situation? That's where hiring a great coach like me, owner of Red Hawk Coaching, one of the first things I do is assess your current situation. From there, we can develop a customized plan to help you achieve your goals. Number two, hiring the right coach, they're going to help focus on solving your specific problem. Not, not a problem they assume, but your problem. See, there's a lot of times that business owners get in their own way. And if we can solve just a few things, sometimes it's often the smallest things you can begin to move the needle in your business. So we're going to look at the specific challenges in your, in your business, and we're going to look for those solutions. You're going to want to hire a coach that is solutions-based. For any challenge, any problem that you're going to face in your business, there is a solution. And as a coach here at Red Hawk Coaching, I'm going to ask you really powerful questions to help uncover the solutions to those specific problems that are going to help you move towards your goals. Number three, hiring the right coach, they're going to ask powerful questions to help you come up with a creative solution to solve your challenge. If you have a coach that's telling you and not asking questions, you've got the wrong coach. Because at the end of the day, me telling you, you might not have the buy-in to the solution. And if I ask you questions and you arrive to that solution on your own, it's going to empower you to take the steps you need to take in order to overcome that challenge. Make sure you're hiring a coach just like myself at Red Hawk Coaching that's going to ask you powerful questions to help you uncover and identify solutions that are specific to your needs. Speaking of hiring the right coach, which is a very important topic, I want to let you know you can find a lot more information on my website at www.redhawkcoaching. There you're going to find information that's going to help you soar, not just in your business, also in life. Make sure while you're there, you sign up for my power packed newsletter that I send out every Friday that's loaded with information, strategies, and tips that's going to help you in your business. You'll also find information about my coaching packages. I offer a three-month, six-month, and annual package. You can also book an appointment with me to ask for questions. That, that appointment is 100% complimentary. I'm going to include down in the, the description of this video a link to my site, www.redhawkcoaching.com. Make sure you visit. Number four, hiring the right coach is going to teach you what true accountability is. That accountability is the self. See, if you can't be accountable to yourself, you're not ever going to be accountable to anybody, whether it be your business, your spouse, your group of friends, your colleagues. And so when we talk about accountability here at Red Hawk Coaching, we're talking about how to be accountable to yourself. Only then will you be accountable to others. Number five, and probably the most important, 
is that when you're looking to hire a coach, you want to get somebody that's going to help you think differently. So if you can change the way you think, you're going to change the way that you feel. And if you change the way that you feel, you're going to change the actions that you take. And if you change the actions that you take, you're going to get completely different results, which goes and either reinforces your programming or changes it. And then the cycle starts over. So here at Red Hawk Coaching, we get you to change the way that you think about things. We get you to look at things with a different perspective. Because when you change that perspective, you're going to change not only your business, you're going to change your world. Now that you've watched this video and know what it requires to hire the right coach, there's still three more important things that I need to share with you. Let's cover those quickly. Number one, waiting to hire the right coach is simply procrastination. Now is the time to hire a coach and make a decision for you and for your business. Number two, Hiring a coach is an investment in your business, not an expense. Businesses make bad investments every day. Instead, make that investment in you. The returns you're going to get from coaching are immense, and those can't be taken away from you. When is the best time to plant a tree? It was 20 years ago. When's the next best time to plant a tree? That is today. What would your business look like in 12 months if you hire a coach like me to move the needle in your business. What are the possibilities that await? By procrastinating and putting off the decision, what are the things that you're missing? If this video stirred your soul today, I'd like for you to reach out to me. Until then, make sure you watch our next video.